As you can see, a gloriously sunny day here at Somerset House on the banks of the river. Very, very poignant, the banks of the river, because we're here for the launch of River Simple. And River Simple is my new bat car. And uh, obviously, when this launch is finished, um, I'm going to ask Hugo if I can take it away. In the meantime, we're just going to go off and have a little look uh, around the car, meet a few of the people who invented this car from scratch, and then interview Hugo. For your delight. See you in a moment. Thank you all so much for coming today. Uh, what we're going to show you is, is a car for the future. I think we all know that climate change is the most pressing threat that we face. And equally, we all know that transport in all its forms, powered by fossil fuels, is a very major contributor to the problem. Unfortunately, the rate of change uh, uh, of, that we've managed over the 12 years since Kyoto is absolutely pitiful. And in fact, since 2000, the rate of increase has actually accelerated. And so we really have got to do better. We think that our hydrogen car, together with the revolutionary way that we plan to build the car and market it, the way we want to run the company, can play a significant part in making the world a cleaner and a safer place. We're here to present a very positive view of a future for sustainable transport. And we want to demonstrate that clean and efficient hydrogen fuel cell vehicles are within our grasp. But River Simple isn't just about the technology, because we believe that the real barriers are uh, a result of the way we organize ourselves and the way we do business. So the second pillar is about the ownership or rather non-ownership of the cars. They will only ever be leased, never sold. It's that we've designed a world-leading car and developed a, a robust strategy for bringing it to market. Now, it's ready to roll. My name is Stuart Dow, I uh, work for BOC here in the UK, part of the Lindy Group of companies. We're uh, a very large industrial gases company. The lesson from this car is that because it's so efficient, we can do infrastructure much more simply. You know, each kilogram goes so much further, so we can deliver a small amount to the customer and they can go a long way on that small amount of hydrogen. And that makes our life much, much easier than trying to deliver hundreds of kilograms to a customer. Hugo is offering a sale for service. I'm speaking on behalf of River Simple here, um, where the customer will pay a monthly fee, a monthly rental for the car, and then at the end of every month they'll get a statement for how many miles they've travelled, and they'll pay for that effectively. But they won't pay the hydrogen costs, so they won't be driving around looking for the lowest cost hydrogen. Uh, my name is Hugo Spowers, and uh, uh, my, my company is called River Simple. Well, it's a partnership, in fact, River Simple LLP. And I've been working on uh, fuel cell technology and cars for 10 years. The choice between all these different powertrains and fuels will be governed in the future by energy efficiency. It is the key metric. And that's how you choose between the different alternatives. If you're looking for vehicles of a range of over 150 miles, there is no technology on the horizon that's remotely as efficient as a fuel cell vehicle, or can be. I mean, there are some inefficient fuel cell vehicles as well. Uh, but that is why I felt that I had something to offer and hydrogen, I mean, that my skills fitted the need for hydrogen and the potential offered by a whole system design approach to harnessing fuel cell technology. So, as I said, I've got the keys and I'm about to leave. No, I mean, it is a fantastic looking car inside. Really, really nice. Very, very simple design, very simple dashboard. Controls, it's obviously completely automatic, with these wonderful wing doors. Incredibly impressive little car. Just about enough room in the back for my golf clubs. This, people, is the future of motoring.